Remember I was telling you before how you can change sounds with the axon just by moving your hands back and forth? Well, here's a great example of that. Here what I'm going to do is I'm going to play two different kinds of bass sounds. First I'm going to start over here. It's like a fretless bass sound. Now I'm going to move to the other part of the guitar. And then I go right back over here to my other sound. I'm going to do that again. And then back over to my fretless. So the question is, how am I doing that? Well, it's the fret splitting feature. At some point on this neck, the sound is going to change from one set sound to another. Let's see where the change is. Whoa, there it is. So what fret is that? The eighth fret. At the eighth fret, I switch to a different sound. Uh, from all the frets down here, it is a fretless, fretless bass sound. And from here on, it's a distortion bass sound. You can do that with any sounds you want, but I just picked these two. I think it sounds really great. It's a great example of how bass players can use the axon to be able to have different bass sounds all over their instrument.